Course Creators, Linda Reed, Annabelle. Welcome back to another course creation tip. I love teaching you how to do handy little things for your course. So welcome back. Today's tip is all about how to create a coupon for your course. So you might create a coupon because you want to do a special newsletter offer or you're presenting at a workshop or you just basically want to give someone a little bit of a bonus and a little bit of a gift. And a coupon is a great way of adding a discount to your course without having to change your whole pricing structure. So that's what we're going to cover today. We're going to cover how do we create that coupon. The bonus little tip that I've got for you in this video is then how you can add that coupon onto your URL so that when you put the link in your newsletter or you create a special bit.ly link or whatever, that coupon is already applied. So there isn't any stress on your recipients and on where to find the coupon box to how to add the coupon code. So let's get started. Let's create a coupon for your course. I look forward to learning, seeing how you use it within your course creation journey. Let me know in the comments. See you later. Okay, now it's time to create that coupon for our course. So let's delve into the settings and create a coupon. And as I mentioned, I'm going to show you two particular ways to do this. We're going to create the coupon and you could email just the coupon code to people, but I am also going to create a special URL that takes the discount off for people as well within our coupon. So let's delve into it and let's get started when we go through our coupon settings over here. Okay, so I'm just going to go into Market and Sell and then under Market and Sell, you'll find the space for coupons where you can create a coupon for any of your courses or all of your courses. You click the new coupon button to be able to create that course coupon and you decide how much you are going to take off. Now, this coupon is particularly a $50 off coupon and for the product, it is for the five minute marketing ideas with me. Um, and do I want to apply it to an additional bundle option? No, I don't because this particular one is for those who've already got a box of cards but you could apply it for another one here and go five minute marketing ideas um, and you go into the additional prices and it pops up here and I could pop it in to do that so that it's got the uh, ideas deck in there as well um, but I'm not going to worry about that I'm going to just keep it on the one pricing and I'm going to go ideas I'm going to make my coupon card and I'm going to make it idea because it's for people who've already bought the five minute marketing ideas cards. It's easy for people to remember. Um, and then I'm going to put an expiration date on it and I'm going to put the expiration date on this one to be the 31st of May to be the end of the month. You don't have to, but you might want to. So I'm going to pop it in here and I'm going to copy the code. Oh, bear with me. Put the code in here. Ideas deck. I'm going to make my coupon code over here. And just go in idea so that it's easy to remember as we just said in the last bit <laughs> and i know that currently there is no more that, that how many people i want to use this one so if i could put in a limit of 400 i could put in a limit of how many people that i've known bought the deck or you can trust people it's up to you when it comes through that area so what i'm going to do is i'm going to limit it to the 400 mark because i know that's how many decks that we've sold so there shouldn't be any more orders than 400 coming through with that coupon and we do when we do our email blast it'll work out i'm just going to hit the save option up the top here and once I hit save, that coupon is now there. And we know our coupon code is IDEA. So we're going to copy this. And I'm going to show you the handy little trick when it comes to Thinkific on you being able to put the coupon code in. So go end of a group and bring, bring your course up or whatever your course URL is. I'm going to go to this course here. And then we're going to add just a handy little bit of code. And we're going to go uh, coupon. Forza. coupon hang on question mark there we go you know I was typing something in wrong coupon equals equals and then we're going to pop in the idea code and pop in the idea coupon and then it see it does the 50 dollars $50 off the original price of $97. So that means people that can pre-order the course only. And then I've got the URL, which is coupon slash idea ready to go. Or I can just email someone with the coupon code and they can enter it in on the box. But this makes it nice and easy for someone because I hit the pre-order button and the coupon's already applied. So there you go. That's how you create a coupon for your course. So you can share it with people and maybe make a special offer or give a free trial out, whatever you'd like to do.